Okay, we're back with a new episode and a new game. Sound a little uh, more up. We're back with a new episode and a new game. You know what? Uh, I don't think this game deserves that kind of energy, but I, you know what? Go for it. So, I, can't, I don't remember. This game. For all you lovely viewers out there who have no idea what the fuck you're looking at. Oh no, can I say the F word within the first 30 seconds? Yes, yeah, only the first 7 seconds. Is it only the 7 se You know, we're not monetized anyway. Um, basically, this is the game that um, when you asked your parents for Gears of War, your mom said, we have Gears of War at home. This is This is the Gears of War at home. This is Wish.com Gears of War. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're in for an adventure. Also, I'm, pl for another. I'm playing this through um, the cloud, through cloud streaming on PlayStation. So if there's any weird delays or glitches, that's the reason. But then again, this game's also bad, so that also might be the reason. When was this game made? 20... I want to say 2010. This was for the PS3 and 360. Um, I think that's fair to say these are fucking awful graphics. For... This game came out a year after Uncharted 2 and many years after Gears of War. So you don't think well, these graphics hold up to those standards? No, he's he he just did a flip and a surf and a, he didn't fall off. Impressive. Looks like there are still some two left. Graphics, like let's let's get one thing out of the way. Graphics aren't everything. That's true. They aren't. But first impressions, yeah, not, these not do good. Not I'd almost say, like, Mario 64 has better graphics. Mario 64 has better graphics than this, you said? Yeah. Oh, God. Um, so this is, this is PlayStation 3. Yes, but I am playing this because I don't... I don't own this game because I would never pay for this. Um, I am playing this. This game is on on PlayStation Plus Premium. It lets you like stream some PS3 games. This is one of them. Why this is on there, I don't know. So, and we just kind of jumped into like this disgusting. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. The, the, the environment is just kind of like gross gross it's, it, it's, it's like if school born with shit environment and like one thing that the scorn does scorn does well is the beat you know it's it looks it's great environment and, and it looks great yeah uh God, you know how in Gears of War the aiming is like really like tight and precise? Oh yeah, yeah. Um Imagine if it was the exact opposite. <laughs> That's why you can in Gears of War you have hordes of enemies. In this you have like three, four enemies at the screen at once. God, I don't know. know. Listen, and, and again, I'm playing this through cloud streaming. And PlayStation's cloud servers are like really, really dog shit. So maybe it's, yeah, like they're not good. So maybe it's because I'm playing through the cloud, but like, Jesus Christ, man. But also this game doesn't look like the type of game to have good aiming anyway. So it's probably not the cloud. It's probably just the game. Yeah. But I'm playing this through the cloud, which means I'm playing a shitty game through the shittiest method possible. 
Yeah. God, how do I reload? Where the fuck is It's double shit wambo. There's no reload button? Just throw the woman. Do I have infinite ammo? Look, my ammo doesn't go down. Just throw the woman. God, I love how you can just whip her. Just, just throw the woman at the enemy. Damn it, I shouldn't be this weak. None of these buttons reload. That's because you, I think it's you have to empty the mag. Oh, okay. You I think it's compulsive reloader. I, I think it's R two. Oh really? That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, it's R two. I don't know what the hell is happening here. It's okay. I'm not making it out. How many of us do? I don't think the developers did either. How's he holding on to that? There's no grips. I thought you could make it, but you're part of Dude, he, he was... Uh, that piece that he was holding on to before, he legitimately flipped upside down. And... What, what am I holding on to now? What... Called it not for dear life. God, you can tell they thought this would be so cool. Absolutely. They're like, look at this guy holding on while it goes upside down. This will be so cool. People will love it. Gears of War who? We're gonna make a Gears of War that's gonna be able to play, be played on all con- Is this on Xbox 2? PS3 and, and Xbox 360. Oh god, they uh... So Xbox players could also play this. And be like... Okay. Are we getting story or...? I mean, he's definitely like, saying something about something. Arcs, arcs, uh, the Ark of the Covenant. Like, Gears of War has a ridiculous plot too, but at least like, like, Gears of War, like, like right away, they're like, this is what's happening. Another tower to take down. Yeah. Yeah, I love walking in place. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the humans are out here. What? Game. Wonder just how well they can fight. Humans? What's he talking about humans? Oh, great. I love it when plot is just described in loading screen text. The world is empty. A decay mass home to only a few remaining survivors. I dedicated my life to, huma to battering humanity. Bettering humanity, not battering. And this is my reward. Cities in chaos. The environment collapsed. War. The end of civilization. Yeah, this is the beginning of a lost age. And more of Exust Lambert, June 15th, 2074. I love it. All right. That was a thing. Hey, are you listening to me? Why are you heading no. for the tower? You think he's what's left of the support troops from the other colonies? <laughs> I haven't heard of any support coming our way. Oh my god. This game's killing Matt, guys. <laughs> I've never seen a weapon like that. Yeah, you know, in like any TV show or whatever, you're like oh, a character coughs and like two episodes later they're dead. Yeah. Yeah, that's what's happening yeah. to me. I have the deadly cough. Game is killing. I'm the leader of this militia. His name is Franz Croft. Franz Croft. You got a name? Sounds evil. God, I want to know this character's name. Infected? What are they infected with? COVID? Infected, yeah. Is that the quantum strain? Name Sid. You know. His name is Sid. That's the best they could come Just up with. Sid. They know they thought this was fucking incredibly cool. Damn it, push it back. Come on. Oh my god. Sit. Look at look at how he looks. He's got an X carved into his forehead. He has blood colored tattoos. What do we call him, guys? Sid. Looks like they're hunting too. Just Sid. Back. Might as 
we'll see how close they can get yep. me. God, remember that era of shooters where every shooter was just brown and gray? Mm -hmm. This is the ultimate brown and gray shooter. <laughs> God, it is so ugly. This genuinely might be one of the ugliest games I've ever played, and I've played Bubsy 3D. Your ass up here and shoot something. Sir, did you just order him to fight? You don't know anything about that guy. Same way, right? I want to keep him where I can see him. Don't worry. God, the aiming is so. Aiming is so bad. Everything in this game seems a little bit in. A little bit. God, will this be the first game we just quit? Maybe we should. This is not good. They thought that would be so cool. Everything this game they thought, uh, they're like, yep. They're gonna love this. The consumers will love this. I feel like if I only had a PS3 and I was like, oh, but I really want to play Gears of War. Oh, look, a new game like Gears of War. I would play this and be like, I think I'm just going to buy a 360. Or, like, PlayStation players would definitely be like, I don't see what's so good about Gears of War. It's all this. Gears of War this, Gears of War that. <laughs> oh, God. It, this game's making me sick. A bad feeling now. God, you know how in Gears of War, when you reload, you have a chance to reload quicker? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The perfect reload. Yeah, right? This game doesn't have that. So you just have to wait 20 seconds for your fucking reload to finish. <laughs> oh my god, the aiming is so bad. Okay, see, I just, he's, he's you see I just pushed this guy out of cover? Yeah. What the you, hell you is think that? You can die? Who, me? Or the other guy? The other guy. I don't know, I hope not. I'd, I'd, I'd hate to have to try to revive someone in this game. God knows what button that would be. Push down on your left stick to revive someone. This is so bad. The aiming is so bad. <laughs> like it's simultaneously too quick and too slow. That's, a, that's an impressive level of shit. It's Sid with a Y. So you know, from, uh... so you know he's cool. Look, look how long that takes to reload. Big, big galoot. Oh, See how cool that looked. Consumers will love that blood explosion. Look, they thought it'd be so cool that he'd hold this gun with one hand. God, he's so strong. He's oh making my, my loins wet. This really might be the ugliest game I've ever played. Hmm. The Watchers observe everything in and around an arc. Destroying a Watcher unlocks its information, which you can review by selecting the eyes of the tower in the pause menu. Oh yeah, a tiny little target with this aiming. Great. That's not... You did it. You did it, Matt. You goddamn did it. Oh, what the fuck? There's someone behind there? This is so incredibly not good. Is this the game? 
that we... Ah, listen, we, we held out through uh, Super Pets and Fast and Furious. But... <laughs> so we gotta give this one at least a, a couple episodes of a chance. This, I mean, you're the one playing it, so... That's true. I love how it, like, says click R3 to look, and it just zooms in on a fucking wall. Like, why? What's so interesting about that muddy, textured wall? Just, like, no point of interest at all. That wall... Took 1,300 game devs to, to, no. I swear, if this, <laughs> 1,300, that's sad. What is this? Is this a gun I can pick up? Grenade launcher. We gotta save Metropolis. I don't know where we are anymore. It's all just brown and gray. Like, it's like people like always used to say, like, oh, Gears of War started this brown and gray. Gears of War had some color in it, man. Nobody knows when that tower was made or even who made it. Like, if you play Gears of War, like, yeah, it's, it's, it's like Gears of War is brown, but there's color, man. Let's teenage wasteland. Nothing ever came up, and nobody could ever get in. The tower was just there. But now it started changing. It's a tower. We don't know what the tower is, but it's a tower. It's even spread into our colony now. I got the worm from. Uh, it's an game? Alaskan bullworm. <laughs> it's a worm from that game. Gears, of, Gears of War? No, can't be. Is it? There's a giant worm in Gears of War. God, this is gonna be the running joke throughout this. The consumer's gonna love this. <laughs> the consumer's gonna love Look at this. Look how great this is. The consumer will love it. <laughs> oh my God, that was was that the whole first level? Or no, we're still in scene one. They call them oh, scenes like this. Is, they call it scenes like this is cinematic. Okay, you got to do the. This is not the world as it should be. This is not the world I envisioned. I see the world on the brink of a war that likes of which has never been seen. Civilization could very well collapse. Or does humanity always manage to transform good into evil? Memoirs of Zeus Lambert, May 3rd, 2072. Wasn't the last one 2074? I don't think so. <laughs> I think it was. <laughs> that would be fucking funny. Why are the why are the memoir entries for the same level two years apart? If the is and why didn't they it. why didn't they start with the uh, twenty seventy two one and then go to twenty? I'm... Who is Zeus Lambert? Where are you? Oh, are you God. the one behind all these men? Mad madness. That's the word I was looking for. Oh my god. This is like This is like the video game equivalent of like when you go to like a like a flea market and see like a DVD and you're like, oh it's this movie, but then you look closer and it's like, wait a minute, this isn't pretty woman. This is this is attractive lady. I love that movie, Attractive Lady. Yeah. This is the Avengers. The Avengers. This is the Revengers. All right, who's next? I love how boring these like these are supposed to be action-packed shootouts, right? It's so boring. There isn't even background music. Did Gears of War have back? I'm pretty sure Gears of War had background music. I'm pretty sure. But like, even if it didn't, like, even if it didn't have background music, like, those shootouts were exciting. I love how you could just stand in the open and just take a look. Let me just, let me just, watch the blood dissipates. I'm good. 
Shoot me, bitch! Shoot me! These are such like these are such boring shootouts. It's because if there was a horde of enemies like Gears of War, you wouldn't be able to shoot them all because the accuracy is so fucking trash. That's true. Like there's no like I don't remember if Gears of War has background music to the shootouts, but like there's things going on, right? There's more sound effects. The enemies shout things and growl, like Marcus Phoenix and the boys, they say things to each other. Right? Yeah. There's like, okay, there's, yeah. there's mid-battle like banter, there's like, I'm out! Reloading! You know, s shit like that. Right? You can, you can hear the locust go, or whatever. This one like, you can hear. This is nothing, this is just... This is just silence with with some gun sounds, and like just no background music. Just like I can hear the wind. The just, just which just makes the whole. It's it's so empty. Man, this is a goddamn masterpiece. How dare you? What would Zeus Lambert think? What the hell's going on, Laney, Cheryl, you see Zeus Lambert. I don't even know if that's how you pronounce it. This is, this is what happens to Sid from Toy Story. Was he, was he spelled Sid with a Y? Hey, I'm, I'm pretty sure. That's the only Sid in no, modern day media that I can think of with a Y. I'm Maybe almost out of ammo completely. Like, where's their ammo? There's no ammo anywhere. The ammo economy is worse than Gears. Just kidding, Gears is great. I was going to say worse than Scorn, but I haven't played Scorn. Yes, Scorn is like not a lot of ammo. But like that's the point of Scorn. Then again, the combat in Scorn sucks, but like the point is that there's not supposed <laughs> to be a lot of ammo, but still. Like gears like there's always ammo in gears. I know. There's always a uh, there's always a new weapon to pick up in gears. Yeah, then you can pick up the enemy's weapon as well. Yeah. Can I pick up these guys' weapon? I don't think I can. Probably not. That would require programming, which is not likely in a game of this shit to like, like the enemies and their weapons just full on disappear. Oh, God, you can't take the enemy weapons. That's their weapon, bro. Don't take. You can't steal their weapons, bro. Why? I was in cover. How did they kill me? Oh, that's why. Well, that's the first death. Oh my god. I was behind Always cover. Have to quit the game. <laughs> <laughs> what would my childhood hero John Cena think? I know. He never played Quantum whatever this game is called. Quantum Theory. Quantum Theory. What's your theory? It's a quantum! My theory is that this game sucks. <laughs> How long you give? <laughs> I we... don't... It's been 23 minutes so far. Like on the shititude level. <laughs> on the so shit shititude. How does As... it compare to Super, Super Auto Pets and Gears? I mean, in uh, Fast and Furious. Fast and Furious. Uh... I think it might be worse. I don't know. I that so. It's definitely I mean, worse than. Pets. It's definitely worse than Super Pets. Yeah. Look at look how he's shooting me behind cover. What's the point of cover? There is no point, Matt. In this game. I can't Survival's aim. not guaranteed. I'm behind cover. The game's not letting me aim. This is a cover shooter where I can't aim. Oh, now it now it's letting me aim. Oh my god. Die, you alien bastard scum. So it's definitely worse than Super Pets. I want to say it's probably worse than... 
Fast and Furious as well. But uh, we'll save Final Judgment for after. But it's definitely worse than Super Pets. That, because Super Pets I could see like a child having fun with. Yeah. And it, it has that adopt a pet mode thing. That's the only redeeming quality of it. Again, like the gameplay of Super Pets was bad, like to us, because it's just the same thing over and over again. But like, to, to like a child who has never played like a Star Fox, like I could see them enjoying that for a bit. Yeah. Um, so it's like, like, this way. So there's enough there that I like, you know, like I, I wouldn't call that game atrocious. This is atrocious. <laughs> it's so dark too. Look at this. Disgusting looking. You can't even see the steps. It's just black. And the brightness is up, too. I, I bumped the brightness up from the default. <laughs> it's a teenage wasteland. Close range combat. On the ultimate shit storm. Look, no weapon. Game. They don't drop a weapon. They just they just dissipate into red. They goo. disintegrate. Matt, what do you expect from this masterpiece? How could you wield enemy technology? Okay, I, you know what? Maybe this is worse than Fast and Furious. <laughs> Fast and Furious was bad, but like, at least it feels like they tried. There was at least some, I mean, they didn't try. Like Except things. The aspects of... Nah, this game, this game is, is. Things happened in Fast and Furious, where like you can tell like the devs at least like they had some idea of what they were trying to do. Like they did every idea they had, they executed every idea they had poorly, but they at least had ideas of what they wanted. And this is just like, you. There's just no ideas here. It's just let's make Gears of War, but but they did it in the most shitty way possible. Shitty walk. This game is just. What if we ruined Gears of War? Like, what is this? What is this reticle? That's a convoluted ass reticle right there. What the fuck? Oh, okay. you're still alive. How? I don't know how I'm alive. I didn't see that there was a barrel there because it's the same color as everything else. Look at look at look at those textures. I said my graphics are better. Like, look, like, what is the shape of this reticle? Like, how does that help anybody? Just give me a normal circle. I don't understand. Like, this like, gorgeous, like this, like, okay, it's a square, but like, at least it's like a real thing I can aim with. Oh, where the fuck did that guy come from? Oh no, we died. We should <laughs> end it. You want to end it? No, we got to beat the level. That's true. That, this, 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 you can beat this thing. <laughs> I like. Where did that? Where did that giant enemy come from? Just the game gives no indication as to where enemies are spawning from. You didn't see him spawn in the gray area? No. I didn't either, so. <laughs> you know how in Gears of War, like, it's quite clear when, when locusts are upon you. They have sounds and effects, and they come up from the ground, and you can hear them. You can hear them right before they show up, and you can hear where they're showing up from. 
-hmm. In this one, they just appear out of thin air. Yeah. They're ghosts. They just... They just... Materialize. Like... I can't get over the shape of this... This Amian reticle. How... Who is this supposed to help? Like... <laughs> why? Oh yeah, let's it's wonderful. Let, let's see what a sniper rifle is like. Oh, better better reticle. God. God bless Ma. You got him, don't worry. Yep, that that worked. My you bullet for 100% just went through him. Yep. Oh my god, the consumer's gonna love that. <laughs> <laughs> the consumer's gonna love that. You know that uh, satisfying head popping sound when you get a headshot in Gears of War? Mm -hmm. Okay, so imagine that um, instead of that, there was just nothing. The consumer will love this. They're going to think this is Gears of War. PlayStation fans. Enjoy. Like, where did they come from? They weren't there when I walked down the stairs. Oh. Um, oh. Okay, we, we can oh. continue to play this game. You got this. You got it, babe. Come on. I don't know why I'm saying, babe. This is, uh... This game's making me, uh... Is the game making you horny? This game's making me horny. From all these... From these beautiful graphics? These graphics are just... Oh. Uh, Rousing the, the shit out of me. Ugh. I love graphics. So good. You know how in cover mat. You know how in Gears of War when you shoot enemies it feels like you're hitting flesh with your gun? Yes. Cause there's like sound effects for the bullets hitting flesh? Oh, baby. Well, this game... The sound effects are so... I bet it feels so good in this game, man. Tell me. Quantum Theory asks the question, what if it felt like you weren't shooting anything? God. Brilliant design choice, game devs. What if you shot an enemy and it felt like your bullets just went through them? But then they Dickinson's died anyway. I'm gonna love it. <laughs> You know how search up who made this game. <laughs> you you know how to... previous episode that people might not have watched. Yeah. Go watch our previous yeah. episodes. Go yeah, watch us play yeah. TMNT when you're done watching us. Yeah, good game. When you're done watching me play this. You know how um, in Gears of War you take cover to avoid enemy fire. Yeah. Well, this game asks the question: What if cover didn't help you? <laughs> You've died in cover. Impressive. Oh my god. I was gonna, I was gonna, I was trying to think of a name that one of the game devs could have been, but I don't want to insult anybody's name. I love it. It's to one of them press, click R three to look at this brown wall. As opposed to that fountain wall. Oh, it's the grave digger! I love it. I killed like 40 enemies. There's one gun that dropped. Incredible. You know how in Gears of War, when you f clean out a battlefield, there's like dozens of guns on the ground from the locust you killed? Yes. Well, this game asks the question, yeah. what if enemies didn't drop any ammo or guns? Debris. Debris. Better to fight him here than back home. All right. 
Looks like we got a fight up ahead. Stay sharp, people. My god. That guy looks like Leatherface. <laughs> I, I just want I just want to reiterate what I said earlier in the episode. This game came out a year after Uncharted 2. And I'm pretty sure the same, like a year before Gears of War 3. So just think about that. Can change in a year. They obviously. Google when. We're not using Unreal Engine 4. Google when Gears of War 3 came out. <laughs> okay. Jamie, right. Google when Gears came out. Gears of War 3 came out in 2011. Okay, so yeah. This game came out a year after Uncharted 3, a year before Gears of War 3. Or Uncharted 2. And it that looks like. It looks like it came out in about. It, this looks like a, a like one of the first ever PlayStation Two games. Yeah, like um, what's it called? Careful, you're behind cover. <laughs> you get shot. <laughs> and uh, I I feel bad saying that because like, PS Two games look better than this. A lot of them. What do you mean, uh, Nintendo 64 games? GameCube games look better than this. Well, GameCube was the same same um, generation as PS2. Shit! Yeah, but it was Nintendo and their technology was not as... The GameCube was actually, like, visually, like, had... Like, visually, the GameCube, like, had the tech to, like, look better than the PS2. Mario Party 1 looked better than this. Can I say that? Yeah. Next victim. Oh, look, it's one of those things I can waste ammo shooting. Bubsy 64 looked better than this. Was there a Bubsy 64? I'm pretty sure it was the unfinished one where all the po it was just polygons and you had to get the that's, shapes. That's Bubsy 3D. Oh, Bubsy 3D. That's the same shit. <laughs> it, wasn't, it wasn't on the N64. Oh, really? It looked no. like an N64 game. It was on the PlayStation. That's interesting. And maybe, maybe also something else. But it was definitely I don't it was definitely on the PlayStation 1. I don't think it was it wasn't on the N64. It's every time it tells me press R3 to look. You know how in Gears of War when it tells you to 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 look at uh, a point of interest? Mm -hmm. And that point of interest is usually something interesting and exciting. Yeah. Well, this game asks the question, what if all points of interest were nothing? Brilliant. Put it in the game, Sid. The consumer's gonna love that. <laughs> what if we have to beat that tower? Like, like go into the tower? Or like you mean fight the tower itself? Um, fighting the tower itself would actually be kind of cool. Like how, know, that's not gonna happen. like how in Superman 64 you fight tornadoes? Yeah. Superman 64 had better graphics than this. <laughs> and better game mechanics. Okay, maybe not. That's a little too much. The locust. I love how, too, just like Years of War, you have your blonde guy, your black guy, and then your main guy. And your squad. He was. He has an X on his forehead to to mark that he's a Nazi. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a swastika? Yeah, but oh, we're on scene two. Okay, we the should. The root of the tower. No, 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 no. We'll end the episode. Scene two will be next episode. Okay. okay? That's um. Right. We there will be at least one more episode of this um piece of crap. Will there be a third? Find out. Same schmuck time, maybe. Same schmuck channel, definitely.